It's a different kind of week this week here on the American Digital Network because it is conference championship week. Eight o'clock, Saturday night, ABC, Cincinnati, and Tulsa are going to get after it for the American Conference Championship. And the unanimous defensive player of the year in the American Athletic Conference is Zayvon Collins of Tulsa. And he's kind enough to give me a few minutes to preview this conference championship game here on the American Digital Network. David, first of all, congratulations. And how much did winning the conference player of the year mean to you and maybe even some of your teammates that you play with? Um, I appreciate that. Thank you. Um, it, it meant a lot to me and my family. Um, you know, I think that's every defensive player in the, um, you know, the American who gets to go out and play and start and play every game. I think that's kind of their goal. Um, I think it means a lot to the teammates because, uh, at least I know if it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be in this position. Uh, you know, they contribute so much to each other's success and, uh, you know, my ability to make plays and their ability to make plays. It's, um, it's, 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 it's insane, you know, how good they are and how much they help me out. And When you think of your success individually this year, Zayvon, what has been the key to you really having a breakout season where you're on the national scene? Um, just, uh, you know, knowing the defense and understanding, you know, the ins and outs and that way I don't have to think when I play, I'm just playing free, playing, you know, very instinctual. Uh, I think that's it and wanting to be a dominant force on the, you know, on the field and making the coaches realize like, hey, you got to know where he's at every play. That was my goal from the beginning of the year and uh, I'm still still going after that. So you're getting ready to play Cincinnati. We know where you're at in the college football playoff top 25. We know where Cincinnati is at in the college football playoff top 25. This is a big time battle. You are the unanimous American Athletic Conference Defensive Player of the Year. You're heading up against the Offensive Player of the Year in Desmond Ritter. When you flip on the tape and you look at Des Ritter, what jumps out to you? Um, great athlete, uh, tall. He has really good speed. Uh, he can hurt you with the arm. He can hurt you with his uh, with his legs. You know, moving and uh, just got to contain him. Trying to make him one dimensional, and uh, you know, you can say that about almost every player. And uh, but really got to do it with him. He's good at his job, and uh, just got to, like I said, make him one dimensional. And uh, that's it. Are there any individual traits about his game that really stood out to you upon film study? Um, yeah, being able to, you know, whenever the, the pass isn't there and not, you know, he makes a clear cut decision, just he'll, he'll eat it and just take off running. And, you know, he's made a lot of great plays this year by doing that. So like I said, you gotta either make him pass or just make him run it and not give him that two way option because that's where you get hurt. Your name has been mentioned with a lot of national awards this year, and rightfully so. How have you handled all of that outside noise? Uh, I kind of just try and ignore it as much as possible. Um, whatever happens, happens. Uh, again, getting those awards is just a, it's just something you hang on the shelf, and uh, it doesn't really, really mean much. But uh, it, it does mean a lot to, to a few people, and. Um, I think it's nice to be rewarded, um, but you, like I said, you can't let the ink get in your eyes, whether it's good or bad, and um, because it can hold, hurt you both ways. Start thinking you're too good and get complacent. Start thinking you're too bad and you'll give up, and um, that's that's basically my take on it. All right, and last thing for you, what will it take as a team – for Tulsa to beat Cincinnati in the American Athletic Conference Championship game coming up Saturday night on ABC. Give me a couple of things that you and your teammates have to do to be able to win this game. You just got to start off, start off fast, start off early on both sides of the ball. You know, move the ball on offense, stop the ball on defense, and that's it. That's all you got to do. And, um, you know, they can't, they can't win if they don't put any points on the board. And, uh, so we got to, it goes both ways for offense and defense for us. You know, they got to, they got to move it. We got to stop them and we got to try our best and never give up until the, you know, the clock hits zero. And I think that's kind of the mentality we're going in with it, into it with. The uh, reigning defensive player of the year in the American Athletic Conference voted unanimously 
by the folks who decide those things here in the American. Uh, we thank Zayvon Collins for the time, man. Good luck on uh, on Saturday night in the American Athletic Conference Championship game. Heck of a season, man. Congratulations. Hopefully you can top it off with a championship. Thanks for joining me today here on the American Digital Network. Good success to you. Appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me.